Hello everybody, this is your boy Kenneth reporting from the K2 Spot, giving y'all a brand new video, and it's on R&B Soul Singer. His name is Earl St. Clair, and this video that you guys are watching me review is his debut EP called My Name is Earl. It's seven tracks of great R&B soul music, but it has elements of like rock also, so you guys will definitely hear you know what I'm saying when you hear me express my review throughout this video, so here we go. Now, track number one is called Pain. When you first hear Earl St. Clair, you guys are going to be very surprised. You're going to be like, this, when you look at him, you'll be like, no way. But when you hear him, he has like, the song Pain, he has like a James, he kind of almost remind me of um, James Brown. It made me think about it's a man's world, but at the same time, it's just talking about dealing with the whole losing love, but at the same time, you're dealing with the pain of it all, and you just feel it deep in your soul, and that's basically what Earl is doing right there, because he is singing from his heart and below. Like, he's getting deep up in there. But when you hear track number two called Three Story Home, I feel like it's one of those jamming tracks you can just be like, okay. But at the same time, it gives you a storytelling element to it, which I like. Because some artists, they can't, don't tell the stories when they sing. But I feel like with him, he does a great job with that. And when you hear track number three, Criminal, it's, to me, I feel like it's one of those edgy but playful tracks that kind of make you think of like Boosie Collins. Boosie Collins and, you know, just like uh, James Brown and, you know, any other deep, like Bobby Womack, just that feel of it all. But when you hear the tracks like Bad Love and Feeling Alive, gave me like the Prince type of um, vibe to it. Mixed with Sly and Family Stone. When I heard it, I was like, okay. Because I feel like it just gave you just that feel of like you get the uh, rock soul element to it. But at the same time. You getting that um, track that's gonna make you bounce and just have a good time too, and maybe just something that could maybe ease your mind. If you're going through some bad times. So that's basically them two tracks you would definitely listen to. But when you get to the track called "Ain't Got It Like That," featuring PJ. PJ is my girl. I love PJ. PJ, you know if I'm you watching this, you know I love you. But you and Earl, y'all have great chemistry together. Cause I like how the song's just talking about both of them are singing about expressing. You know, maybe just like the love of it all and saying sometimes we want we want to have it that way about life, but we don't maybe like material things or maybe just trying to have a better lifestyle or maybe just a better life in general. And that's basically what that song is basically entitling of what you're trying to say. I ain't got it like that, but you may think I do, but really I don't. So just make sure, you know, looks are looks aren't, you know, looks aren't looks are deceiving, but don't think that I may have it that way because you see me express it a certain way. That hopefully it makes sense. And then the last track is called Beautiful War. Rock soul feel to it. So I feel like anybody that just likes rock, but at the same time you like the soul feel to it. But at the same time you want something that make you think deeply about and something that kind of make you think of like old school R&B soul. That's definitely a track you want to check out right there. And overall, Earl St. Clair, you did your thing, brother, on this EP. I was impressed. And he's also signed to Def Jam. That way you guys want to know. And a lot of people are saying, where can I hear him? Um, like social media or maybe website. His website is earlstclair.com and everything is down here in the description box so you don't have to worry about trying to write everything down. And also subscribe to his YouTube channel, which I have also down here in the description box. And if you want to keep up with him, he is on Twitter and Instagram at Earl St. Clair. And it's E-A-R-L-S-A-I-N-T-C-L-A-I-R. And that's on his Twitter and his Instagram, Earl St. Clair. And if you want to keep up with me, and hope you guys do, I'm on Twitter and Instagram at KTooks. The show that you're watching on YouTube, the KTooks Spot, it does have a Twitter page at KTooks Spot. Also, make sure you please thumb this video by liking it. Make sure you share the video and make sure you comment. If you've heard the full EP from Earl St. Clair called My Name is Earl, let me know what you guys really think about his EP. Do you feel like he did a great job? Did it give you reminiscence of like old school favorite um, artists? Or maybe I should say the classic season artists. Let me correct myself. You know, let me know what you guys really think about it. Did it really blow you away? You know, just be honest with me after you finish listening to the full, you know, all the seven songs. And also, make sure you please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. It's so simple. You push the subscribe button down here, and then you push the bell icon to get notifications for every time I drop videos. And you're always welcome to watch my previous videos when I first started YouTube to up till now. Just in case this may be your first time watching me, you want to get a feel with your boy Kenneth and the K2 Spot is all about, you're more than welcome to do that. And join the ride with your boy right here. And I'm going to give you the real and give you the exclusive too. And that's all I have to say. So this is your boy Kenneth signing off from the K2 spot. And you guys have a blessed one. And you'll see me again next time. So bye-bye.